This answer is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your Shopify questions or tasks on demand. That is DataBuzzer.com. So this is one ink and cartridge website where we have divided many products as per its category and its tag. So I'm taking one example. This is the product. There is vendor, there is product type, and also we have tagged uh, relative to this product. There are many tags available for this individual product. I'm explaining you how all these things working together in the site. Before I'm going further, I'm just giving a brief what is product type, vendor, collection, and tag. Product type can simply be defined as what type of product it is. In this case, it is ink cartridge product. So the best product type it is as ink cartridge. Now the vendor, we can consider vendor as who is making this product. In this case, the Lexmark is the vendor who is making this product. So we have considered this Lexmark as the vendor. Collection. Collection means what are the category where this product can fit. Printer supplies. Uh, this product, ink cartridge, is a part of printer supplies. So we have fit this thing into printer supplies. And the rest of the thing, it is totally depending upon you, like in which category you want to put this product. Tag. Tag is something that we can uh, relate to this product. We have uh, several tags as per the printer supplies. Suppose uh, in the printer Z735, this, print, this ink is fitted properly. So we have considered this as tag. We can tag anything that is related to the product. Now I am showing you how this tag will give us the benefit in our website. You can definitely see that this product type, the vendor and the collection is showing directly in the website. If we go to printer supplies, you can see this product. And if we open this product directly, you can see the vendor, the product type. Now I am going to the product section, sorry, the collection section and in the collection section, if we just find by this tag, you can see all the product that is tagged with this one will come up in this collection page. So right now I'm in the printer supplies collection page and if we add this one means I'm filtering all the printer supplies product with the tag Z735. You can see two products have come up. It means two products has tagged with this Z735. Do the same with more products like more tags. Consider hot deals. If there is any space in the tag, it is replaced by the dash sign. What this URL is doing, this URL is opening the collection printer supplies and within the printer supplies, it is uh, opening all the products that is tagged as hot deals. There are many products. There are 191 products that is tagged as hot deals. To find it easily, I'm just shorting the product as per its price. Here is the product. Now coming to the last question that is given over here. If I have defined a product type as 
vanities can i have the same tag name added vanities in the tag it is completely up to you that you want to add the vanities as product type and tagged as vanities if you tag the product as vanities you will get the advantage over here if you add the product as product type as vanities you can show the vanities product type in the product details page like here it is completely valid you are doing nothing wrong by adding the same value to the product type and the tag thank you was this helpful ask a shopify question now askquesty.com